Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Advice to Think Twice. My name is Monica and I'm here with your daily advice reading for June 14th, 2016. And this is a general reading looking at the energies that surround us at this time, what we need to know about these energies, how we can use them for our highest good. Um, so therefore it's a reading going out to everybody watching regardless of zodiac sign. Um, so use your intuition and take away the messages that resonate with you, that ring bells for you and make sense um, given where you are in, in life and what you're trying to manifest at this time. So the first card that we have um, is the Nine of Wands and the Nine of Wands is the influence of, our, of the past on our current situation. So this is talking about... Um, today being about that time in our lives when we've had to really persevere that time in our lives when we've had to endure and just keep going no matter what um, not give up on our dreams and not give up on our plans regardless of whoever was trying to tell us differently or people who didn't believe in us or um, obstacles of all kinds this is us just sticking to our guns. This is us just um, moving forward, just just sticking with it, okay? Not giving up. Even though we um, are tired and, and uh, bruised and battered, okay? In the image of the Nine of Wands, this is telling us that we're still standing. We're still going, okay? We're still moving forward. We're not giving up. And so this is... Um, that time that the nine of wands talks about is the biggest influence on our today which today we have the five of swords and the five of swords is a card that talks about change and the chaos that comes with change the chaos that comes while we get our footing while we make sense of our new surroundings and the five of swords tells us that Oftentimes, um, with change comes, um, you know, maybe the end of certain relationships or um, other relationships kind of looking differently. Um, through change, we have to stick to our plan, okay, with the Nine of Wands. This is telling us to just stick to what we know and continue to have faith in ourselves and in what we're trying to accomplish. Continue to have faith in our dreams and the fact that they are going to come true. And this, with the Five of Swords, it's talking about whoever needs to leave your life at this time, just let them go. Um, I do feel that today is going to be a day when things become clear for us in terms of who we can trust and who's not really our friend or who really doesn't have our best interest at heart. Um, now, for whatever reason, um, maybe someone doesn't believe in us, okay? Maybe that's just their own fears talking and it's not something that is actually about us and it's more about them. This card tells us to allow for things to happen, okay? Allow for things to change. If people want to leave your life, if people don't believe in what you do, um, if people don't believe that um, you should pursue your dreams or anything like that, I feel like you really don't need those people in your life anyway or you don't need to count on their opinion as much as you thought you did so with the five of swords this is a cutting away of the old and embracing of the new it's a bit of growing pains so maybe a bit difficult today um, communication may be a bit off or unusual in terms of maybe you're gonna have some conversations that you didn't anticipate to have with someone you thought truly believed in you and it turns out that maybe they're not really getting what you're trying to accomplish or maybe they're not as supportive as you thought. Again, for whatever reason, things are happening the way they are meant to, okay? We have to believe that we are moving on the right track. We have to believe that um, as long as, you know, we're pursuing our dreams, our happiness, we're not hurting anyone, we have to believe that things are going to happen for us and just keep doing what we're doing. Just don't stop and don't give up if someone doesn't believe in us, okay? It could be a test, for example, um, for us to prove to ourselves that, no, you know what, even though this person doesn't believe in me today, I believe in myself today and that's enough, all right? Because our perceptions are changing and the way we think 
is changing today okay and i do feel that we're heading into a better place because we're moving into the energy of the knight of pentacles and the knight of pentacles talks about um we're moving into what is truly valuable to us what truly matters to us what truly gives us happiness and security and stability in our lives and this is going to be different things for different people uh, it could be someone's job it could be someone's partnership it could be someone's relationship it could be someone's family um, someone's health and well-being different things for different people however i do feel that today with the five of swords there is a cutting away of things that no longer serve us because we have grown we have evolved and so it's normal for our surroundings to change to match who we are now okay our new um our new selves um and so some things are going to continue on with us and some things are going to remain in the past and that's okay um really focus on what matters to you okay with the knight of pentacles it's a day for us to just cut away everything else and everyone else cut away drama or ups and downs or other people's opinions or other people's energy um just focus on ourselves and our dreams and what we're trying to accomplish and believing in ourselves having confidence in ourselves and our dreams and the fact that we are being helped the fact that the universe and god and our spirit guides and our angels are working with us on this so we're not alone all right and just allowing for the for for changes to happen today i do feel that there are going to be things that we can control today and there's going to be things that are going to be outside of our control and especially when we're dealing with other people and their own opinions and their own free wills and their own history and their own issues all right so it's a really good day for us today to just focus on our spirituality just take a step back allow for changes to happen the way that they will embrace the changes embrace the new energy and believe that we're heading um on the right track and we're moving towards things that truly matter to us and making progress with those things that truly matter to us okay because the knight of pentacles it is a knight so it's talking about change it's talking about action it's talking about progress but we're taking our time we're doing things nice and steady okay slow but steady wins the race so i feel like this is just one step in that process where our outside world may be changing to match our inside world because we have grown and changed evolved all right so any changes that are happening today i feel like go with the flow embrace the changes don't take things personally um i do feel that if if there are going to be any kind of difficult conversations um it's more on the other person it's more their issues than your issues um and so just don't take things personally i feel like the best course of action is you know what I know what I'm doing and I'm pursuing my happiness I deserve to pursue my dreams and um, I truly believe that I will make them happy and I will make them happen and I will be happy okay and anything else and everything else whoever wants to come with me that's fine I embrace it and whoever um, needs to you know kind of you know go to the back seat or just leave my life completely I embrace that too because I believe it's taking me on the right path obviously um don't get engaged into any kind of conflict today okay with the five of swords it's not the easiest energy and you may have people coming at you or kind of telling you words that could be hurtful but again i do feel that it's more their issues than our issues so with the five of swords it's just saying you know what hold your ground you know what you believe in you're not hurting anyone and if anyone doesn't understand or believe in what you do or believe in you then that's okay just take a deep breath wish them well and watch them go okay because we know what matters and that's exactly what we're moving into and we have spiritual partnership back number 27 so this tells me that you know what we are not going through this alone and if anyone needs to leave our lives today then that's fine we have other people better people uh, like-minded people entering our lives today so it's kind of that saying where you need to clear out the old to make room for the new almost and this is all about new people new connections uh, spiritual awakenings spiritual experiences um they're really going to happen for us today and 
give us this clarity that we are doing the right thing and give us this peace of mind that whatever is going on and however our world is changing today it's for the better um, and that it will give us that sense of comfort and calm through maybe some difficult um, energy today okay because it will keep us focused on what matters you may in fact meet a mentor today or you may become someone else's mentor there's definitely um, someone entering your life today that is a like-minded person you don't have to explain yourself to this person they just understand what you're about because they're about the same thing um, and alternatively I do feel that if this is not an actual person entering your life today I do feel that this is going to be a day when we hear our spirit guides easier where we hear our angels easier when we receive their guidance more clearly so pay attention to what's going on signs symbols synchronicities um, I do feel that they will help us through this you know growing pains type energy day and keep us moving forward in the direction of what matters to us all right and if anyone's getting too much for you or really getting on your nerves or anything like that or getting you you know feeling disappointed or anything um, I do feel reach out to someone because um, you're going to form a spiritual partnership with someone um, a friend or an acquaintance or an expert of some kind um, a teacher just someone who you trust um, and I feel like that will be a big big help for you today all right but remember growing pains are a natural thing and it's it's good because that's how we know that things are actually moving that things are actually happening for us because we see changes and change is not always comfortable except you know um, especially when it's growing pains all right that's a perfect example of change that is not always comfortable but it is always for the better all right so just remember focus on your spirituality today talk to someone who's a like-minded person someone you trust someone who um, helps you connect to your spirituality easier or talk to, to god your angels your spirit guides today i do feel that they will give us the sense of calm and inner peace inner knowing that Everything is fine, and no matter what's going on or who's around us or what they're saying or anything like that, everything is going well and we are heading in the right direction and we're going to be fine. This change is ultimately a good thing for us. All right, so that's the message that, uh, that we have for today. Um, let me know how, how this makes sense, okay? Let me know how this resonates with you um, and if it's helpful. Thank you so much for being here with me. Thank you for all your support. Um, I do hope that we have a blessed day and I will talk to you tomorrow. Take care.